Beneath the picturesque landscapes of southern Italy lies a geological giant capable of reshaping not only its surroundings, but the world itself. This colossal force hidden in plain sight has slumbered for centuries, its immense power concealed beneath a deceptive tranquility. However, recent tremors, ground deformation, and the faint hiss of volcanic gases escaping the Earth's crust suggest that the giant is stirring once more. What makes this natural wonder particularly extraordinary is its potential to unleash an event of unimaginable scale, an eruption that could blanket entire regions in ash, disrupt global climates, and alter the course of human history. Its past eruptions have carved out entire landscapes, influenced ancient civilizations, and left behind a legacy of awe and fear. Now, as scientists monitor the shifting ground and ominous seismic swarms, the question lingers. Is Europe's most dangerous supervolcano finally waking up? If so, what are the potential consequences of its catastrophic eruption? Let's find out. Don't forget to click on that subscribe button and like this video, as it's the best way to support this channel. Campi Flegre, nestled near Naples in southern Italy, is a geological marvel and one of the most volatile volcanic systems in the world. Known as the largest supervolcano in Europe, its caldera stretches across an area of roughly 13 kilometers. Campi Flegrei's story began thousands of years ago, shaped by a series of cataclysmic eruptions. Two major eruptions define its geological narrative, the Campanian Inimbrite eruption, approximately 39,000 years ago, and the Neapolitan Yellow Tuff eruption, around 15,000 years ago. The Campanian Inimbrite eruption is particularly significant as one of the largest volcanic events in the past 100,000 years. It expelled hundreds of cubic kilometers of ash and pyroclastic material, creating a caldera and reshaping the landscape of the region. These eruptions not only impacted the local environment, but also had global climatic consequences. The Campanian in Imbrite eruption is hypothesized to have contributed to a temporary cooling period on Earth, affecting ecosystems and possibly human populations. The deposits from these eruptions are still visible in the geological record, providing clues about the magnitude and impact of Campi Flegre's volcanic activity. In recent decades, Campi Flegre has shown signs of unrest. The region has experienced episodes of ground uplift due to magma movement or the accumulation of geothermal fluids beneath the surface. These episodes, marked by increased seismicity, deformation, and fumarolic activity, have become more frequent and pronounced. One of the most alarming indicators of Campi Fligre's reawakening is the increase in earthquake swarms. For instance, in May 2024, a notable seismic swarm occurred, comprising approximately 150 earthquakes over several hours. The most significant was a magnitude 4.4 quake at a depth of 2.6 kilometers beneath the Solfatara area, marking the strongest event since the ground uplifting began in 2005. This swarm led to the temporary evacuation of 36 families due to safety concerns. Seismic activity has persisted beyond May 2024. On December 6, an earthquake swarm lasting about 11 hours was recorded, with the largest event being a magnitude 3.4 quake. Besides seismic activity, there is the issue of ground deformation. Since the 1950s, the Campi Flegre region has been steadily rising. During the 1982 to 1984 crisis, the caldera experienced a dramatic uplift of nearly 2 meters forcing the evacuation of thousands of residents from the town of Pozzuoli. More recently, ground uplift rates of about 2 centimeters per month have been recorded, indicating ongoing subsurface activity. This deformation is closely monitored as it provides a direct measure of the pressure buildup beneath the volcano. Meanwhile, changes in gas composition and temperature are closely studied as they can reveal shifts in magma depth or hydrothermal processes. Increased fumarolic emissions in recent years suggest that the magmatic system is evolving. Campi Flegre's potential for devastation stems from its classification as a supervolcano. 
Unlike typical volcanic eruptions, which release material in a relatively localized area, supervolcanoes can eject massive amounts of ash, gas, and pyroclastic material into the atmosphere. Such events can have far-reaching consequences, including widespread destruction, climate alteration, and disruption to agriculture and infrastructure. An eruption of Campi Flagre could devastate the densely populated region around Naples. The immediate effects would include pyroclastic flows, ashfall, and lava flows, threatening lives and infrastructure. The region's high population density exacerbates the potential for catastrophic human and economic losses. Beyond the local impact, a major eruption could inject large quantities of ash and sulfur dioxide into the atmosphere, potentially leading to a volcanic winter. The cooling effect from reduced sunlight could disrupt global weather patterns, agricultural yields, and ecosystems. Given the stakes, Campi Flagre is one of the most closely monitored volcanic systems in the world. Italy's National Institute of Geophysics and Volcanology leads efforts to track seismicity, ground deformation, and gas emissions. These data are integrated into risk assessment models to anticipate potential scenarios and inform emergency planning. Advancements in technology have enhanced the ability to monitor volcanic systems. GPS networks and satellite-based interferometric synthetic aperture radar are used to measure ground deformation with high precision. Seismic networks detect and locate earthquakes, while gas spectrometers analyze fumarolic emissions. These tools provide critical real-time data for understanding the volcano's behavior. At the same time, local authorities and civil protection agencies have developed contingency plans to respond to potential eruptions. These include evacuation protocols, public education campaigns, and hazard maps outlining areas of highest risk. However, the challenge lies in balancing preparedness with minimizing unnecessary alarm, as false alarms or overly cautious measures can disrupt daily life and economic activities. Despite advances in monitoring, predicting volcanic eruptions remains a complex and uncertain science. Compi Flagre's extensive history of activity adds layers of complexity as its behavior does not always follow predictable patterns. Distinguishing between magmatic and hydrothermal signals in the caldera is difficult. Both processes can produce similar seismic and deformation patterns, complicating interpretation. Scientists aim to identify thresholds of pressure or gas composition that might indicate an imminent eruption but these thresholds vary between volcanic systems and are not always well understood. While short-term forecasting has improved, predicting activity over months or years remains elusive, leaving uncertainty about the timing and scale of potential eruptions. History provides critical lessons for understanding and mitigating volcanic risks. One of the most infamous eruptions in history is that of Mount Vesuvius in 79 AD. This catastrophic event buried the Roman cities of Pompeii and Herculaneum under meters of ash, preserving them as archaeological treasures, but also highlighting the destructive power of volcanic activity. The eruption of Mount Vesuvius offers insights into the potential dangers posed by large volcanic systems like Campi Flegre. It serves as a reminder of the speed with which volcanic events can escalate and the necessity of rapid, well-organized evacuation plans. The lack of preparedness and understanding of volcanic hazards during ancient times resulted in significant loss of life. Another valuable historical lesson comes from the 1815 eruption of Mount Tambora in Indonesia, which caused the year without a summer. The global climatic disruptions from Tambora's eruption, marked by crop failures, food shortages, and widespread social unrest, demonstrate the far-reaching consequences of massive volcanic events. These examples underline the importance of monitoring and preparedness, not just locally but globally, as volcanic activity can transcend geographical boundaries. Compi Flagre is not the only supervolcano that warrants attention. Similar systems such as Yellowstone in the United States and Taupo in New Zealand are also closely monitored. These volcanoes share common features, including large calderas, geothermal activity, 
and the potential for catastrophic eruptions. As we stand at the crossroads of scientific discovery and natural hazard, Campi Flegre serves as a reminder of the dynamic and interconnected nature of our planet. The future of Campi Flegre remains uncertain, but vigilance and preparedness are paramount. As seismic swarms and ground deformation continue to signal subsurface activity, scientists are refining their models to better understand the volcano's behavior. Collaboration between international research teams and local authorities is critical for effective monitoring and response. While it is impossible to predict exactly when or if an eruption will occur, ongoing advancements in technology and risk management provide hope for minimizing its impact. For now, the focus remains on balancing scientific exploration with safeguarding the millions of lives that call this volatile region home.